went to back her off the lift yesterday and uh, this wheel right here locked up and then I went forward and then I went back and it locked up again after a minute or two and uh, watch this now this is my warning light for brakes oh watch her not do it you sorry dog <laughs> well imagine that illuminated so I was going to town to uh, get some stuff, some bu those building supplies you saw back there. And that light came on a couple times, and you can pump it and make it go off. Well, my guess is there's some busted hardware uh, back there on my old Dana 45 axle. So, uh, hmm, I'm going to pull the wheels off. I'm probably going to get uh, hardware and drums and pads for the whole thing. Because perhaps this new system I put in, if you look back a couple episodes, I put in a tandem system, and that's why that light works, like on old Spitfire, stuff like that. It has a shuttlecock in there, and it'll make contact. But let's see if it'll come on again. No. Well, let's get, I'm going to roll a little bit, see if I can make it come on. Let's see if it'll come on before I get to the barn. The pedal went further down. We're gonna, we're gonna just do this thing till it does it. I might see a weeble wobble, but I'm just gonna go grow until it does it again. There's nobody on my road, so let's see if it goes off. Might as well be a little pastoral scene here. Okay, let's try it now. Nope. Now, that gummit. They got all those markers out there for whatever they whatever they planted. That wheat's really thick. Look how it's turning into wheat. Look how wheat does that. Try her now. No, she's not doing it. That gum ya. But I've got a, I've got probably 70% of the pedal that I see who's clear right. We're not going right now. I'm on the other right. Okay. See. Well, until they round it up there, can't you? Nobody's behind me, that's good. Alright, let's see. So, my thinking is there's a, a pad has come off or a spring has broken. The spring has sprung. Let's just go up to uh, there. It is. Yay! See, I told you. I'm trying to tell you. And if you pump it, see, it goes off. So there's something clearly uh, amiss back there. I got a new ignition lock there. See, the old kind. You can't pull the key out like the old kind when it's running. All right, let's see if it does it again. I feel like there you go. See, my pedal's way down. But see, I, I can pump it up, and you can clearly tell that the pedal comes up. So there's something, something going on back there. And so I got to take the drums off and everything to measure these brakes. This being a 1957, and I'm not sure if it's the original axle back there. I'm just going to have to kind of uh, kind of wing it a little bit, and uh, I'm hoping that I can look that up and get them. i got to get the bolt pattern too, so you've got to get all that stuff to uh, make sure you get the right drums. But uh, if the front drums are the same as the back, then you know you're probably okay. I think I'll be okay. You know what to do. Subscribe! We're under the right rear. That's not brake fluid. I don't know what that is. Let's just go up here and look. Ooh, it is brake fluid. Okay, well, we'll tighten that up. I just I'm surprised by that. All right. Well, I just did these. Oh, look at how wet that is. But that ain't because of that. That's dry right there. All right. Well, let's get this wheel off because this is the one that was locking up. But let's 
Let's tighten that up while we're at it. Oh, let's just slide over here. A couple other things I was curious about before I get out from under here. I noticed that the uh, this was dry right here where I rebuilt this axle. And that's real good because I just wiped it off with my hair. No, just a little bit. It is weeping out of this hole right here a little bit. I don't think that's anything I did anything with. But we'll make a note to uh, seal that up. Okay, well, let's tighten up that brake fitting. Okay, my welded in springs are good. And, uh, okay, everything else looks pretty fair. That wet spot there is just from... Uh, being out in the wet grass. So, all right, let's get some measurements here. And then we're going to take this side up, drop it down. We're going to do this side over here because I'm not real sure if the front and rear brakes are the same size. But I'll have it forever on a video now, won't I? And that's good enough for me. Well, let's find out together. Make sure the emergency brake is off. Well, it sounds like something rattling in there could just be my imagination something maybe stuff falls out yep whoa look at that <laughs> i gotta take a picture of that and send it to mick well oh and there's the other one. Oh my gosh look at this that'll do it right there Tell you what, it could be that new system I put in there, but uh, those are just gone, man. I am shocked by this. I think those drums look pretty good, but the shoes don't. Oh man, amazing! Well, uh, let's let's. Uh, I don't think I've ever seen anything like that before. I've seen all kind of stuff. I. I seen them worn out right in the middle right here where they uh where they'll break into pieces. I don't think I've ever seen these fail like this. And both of them. I guess one might knock the other off. Thank goodness it didn't have no uh well maybe I shouldn't thank goodness it didn't have rivets because that might have held them on there. But wow. I am so shocked by that. Okay, well I'm gonna get a picture of this. All right, I see. lucky I made it home, huh? Now let's talk. Let's talk about this thing. These are 11-inch brakes, okay? And the shoes, well, they're easy to measure because they're right there. They are two-inch. I think all of that is pretty common. So 11, two-inch, and I'm just going to get a kit and hope it works. So all right, 11-inch by two-inch. All right, yeah, losing the light here. So we got a uh, five and a half by six. Three, four, five, six. So five and a half, six. Not that that matters, because I don't think I need drums. The drums look pretty thick. Now, uh, let me get you off here again. God, that's amazing to me. All right, well, yeah, I think the drums look fine. I'll just, I'll just hit them with some a wire brush or something because it works let's let's uh put the wheel back on here let this down go pull those off and measure those i bet they're the same what do you think okay uh, it's got a little bit more light over here now let's see if there's anything surprising here those sound all together to me because of the way it's flapping the springs So let's measure them anyhow. Uh, can I get the light a different way? Yeah, I can. All right, let's get the measurement here. So I'll have it. Imagine they're the same. 11 by... Yep, 11 by 2. And we've got the same pattern there, I'm sure. Yeah, I can tell by looking. Okay, so 11 by 2s, I think that's about as common as it gets. And I do believe that the... Uh, 
hardware is the same. I'm gonna put this wheel back on here. Okay. So you know it's the same bolt pattern because you can move the wheels around. All right, let's just take a look at the springs. For all I know, those are wrong. I, I don't know. So let me let me uh, check back here because I wanted to see if it was find the bleeder. Let's see if I can look at it by gantries in the way. All right, all right. There's the bleeder. That's dry. Okay. So that's good. All right, well, let's go get hardware kits, shoes, and I think that's all we need. Wow. So front and back are the same. All right, well, cool. We're not going to make this a great big long endeavor. Uh, so we are going to uh, wrap this up right now because I don't know when I'm going to get the parts on. We're going to have time to fix it. So I just kind of want, I really want to show what I found about the the bonded uh, brake shoe uh, pads, just both of them came off. Interesting, and caused other problems, so that's the way it goes. I, I don't know, I just don't know anymore about stuff. Let's see if I can get them riveted. Although that's dangerous too, because when you wear them out, you go into your drums, but at least you got some satisfaction knowing they're gonna be there, right? Right, 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 right.